Hello everybody. So did a trip to Walgreens and um, got the usual Fairfield boxes, but then there's something new. Um, and of course it says one in eight has a hit. So that's, I know it's basically the same stuff, but um, I think this one's a little bit newer and we'll just see how it, how it looks here. Um, also, this one feels a little heavier. So let's just see. We'll do the old one. Well, I call it the old one, but we'll do that one first. See what we can find in here. Sometimes these are pretty decent. Sometimes these are terrible. Looks like the pack in there is something maybe a little different. Oh, so these Golden Age Panini. Now that's I haven't seen these in, in the Fairfields in a while. You can get hits in here and variations. There's the odds. Oh, that'll be interesting to open. So, all right, let's see what we can find here. So they do throw in some new stuff. Oh, look at that. A 1970 tops they threw in there. Now I have not seen that ever. Yeah, it's a common, but still. Huh, interesting. All right, so... 89 Donross. It's 89 Upper Deck. There's a Lupinella, 84. So far, these are all straight, too, not all over the place. Bruce Benedict, Jose Mesa, Jeff Kent, oh, some of these are wild, I can't even find the name, Donnie Elliott, Frank Viola, Ricky Hatcher, Jared Wright, Kenny Lofton. Austin Dekar, first Bowman. All right, so that was pretty, I mean, not much there except the 1970 card. That's cool though. Let's just see what's in here. Now it says, I can barely see it, it's so tiny. Parallels, short prints. It's hard to see what's in there exactly, so I don't know how to tell. But anyway, Red Grange, Rusty Stub, another Red Grange. This looks like a parallel. Huh. And it's a little car there. Kennedy, Gene Tennis. Now that's interesting. All right, so let's check out the new one. Let's see get something good out of there. So the pack is a, a 90 upper deck, which is not too bad. There's errors to look for and such. Justin Morneau, Alan and Ginter. There's a Paul Goldschmidt, who's the all-star game car. That's kind of neat. Could be MVP this year. Never heard of this guy. <laughs> Interesting. And there's some giveaway thing in here. That's weird why they put that in there. So here's a 1980 card. Interesting. Noah Senegar. Roberto Perez there. And this is Jose Ramirez. Is that, uh, I don't think it's a rookie. No, it's not a rookie, but pretty cool. Scott Rowland, who should be in the Hall of Fame. Tori Hunter, Carlos Beltran, Aaron Cook. 
Jordan Banks. There's Carlton Fisk, Hall of Fame. Matt Dominguez, rookie. Don't know who that is. <laughs> Rosio Iglesias, Topps Chrome. I mean, that's interesting there. Johnny Damon, a, cr a mini Chrome. Sean Hurley, don't know who that is. Evan Gaddis, Johnny Cueto, Marco Gonzalez, Wander Javier, a Miguel Cabrera. Holiday. I don't see that it's a short print or anything, but that's still cool. Sean Green. Nice. Shane Halter. Don't know who that is. Oh, you know, I saw this Will Smith on the back. I thought, hey, Will Smith rookie, but it's the Giants pitcher. Palmero. There's Clemens. Rondell White. All right, so nothing spectacular. Let's check out the 90 Don Ross. Otherwise, I still like the fact, that even though it's a common, there's a 1970 Tops in there. And then those golden, what do they call it? Golden Age cards, kind of neat. So Howard Johnson is Barry Larkin. Matt Williams, McGuire, Drift. All right, so again, not spectacular, but interesting stuff in there. And again, they're only four ninety nine each, so not too bad. All right, give me a sub if you haven't already. Click the like button, and we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.